Hi all, welcome back to Step Campus. This is our last session for articulation. We have prepared two lists as of now for articulation, one for all the lecture videos and second for all the MCUs of the course related to Wings 1. So today we are going to start with the last few topics which are proximity types, types of nature and six C's of a story. So let's get started. Proximity is nothing but the space between the two people. So there are two types of spaces, private and public. In private, pre people prefer to allow great distance between each other. There are guarded interactions with fewer people and in others need permission, cross boundaries and approach co closer. Countries which follow uh, private space are USA, UK and Norway. How does this play out? Intimate and personal space is reserved for friends and family. Arm's length interactions are common for professional associates of any gender. There is a distance when you talk with someone who is your colleague. In public venues such as standing in an elevator or sitting on a bus, people prefer to maintain as much space as possible. They do not uh, stand too close or sit too close to one another. People of different genders can interact fairly easily. In public space, people are comfortable with closer interactions and diverse range of with diverse range of people. There is easy crossing of boundaries, like they interfere in each other uh, each other's spaces. Countries which follow this are India, Brazil, and Spain. How does this play out? Is intimate and personal spaces for extended family and one's community. Arms length and interactions are preferred for strangers. If you don't know someone, they'll you will then only stay away from that or then only have arms length distance. Public areas are comfortable and uh, standing and sitting in close close proximity with another. So in buses and in India we have seen like in the buses and in the public transports we stand too close or we stand. Uh, uh, we sit too close to each other, so that is what a pub, uh, public space is uh, there for us. In some cultures, people of a, of the same genders can stand and sit close together, but people of opposite gender must maintain certain distance. So this was regarding the proximity or the space between the two person. Coming to next is uh, types of nature. So there are three types of nature, control oriented, harmony oriented and constraint oriented. In control oriented nature, people hold the belief that they can control the nature and determine the outcomes. The countries which follow so are USA, Canada and Australia. How does this play out? People believe that they can change their specific needs. People believe that they can change uh, their specific needs and know what they have to study or work hard to get in a successful life. Little is attributed to luck, fate or providence. Harmony oriented, people believe that they should live uh, with nature in harmony. There is easy crossing of boundaries. People who follow this are traditional tribal cultures. How does this play out? People try to create a balanced life. There is con concerted effort in respect and take care of people, animals and nature. Constraint oriented. People believe that God or nature impose limits on man's options or ability to change the things. Countries or cultures which follow this are Muslim culture. How does this play out is people assert that fate influences that, co that are the course of their lives. Like it depends all on the destiny. There is an acceptance that things happen for a reason. Like it, since this had to be happened, that is why this is happening. They have a mindset of that. So this was about the proximity. Uh, the next and the last topic for the articulation is six C's of a story. This is this is one of the important topic with respect to exam as well as, but it is very simple and easy at the same time. The six C's are context, characters, chain of events, catch, change, and case to point. Think it as a movie where a movie. In a movie, it's when it starts, it describes a context like what is the place, what is the mood, what is the issue, every and other things. And then the characters are introduced. What are their personalities? What uh, are their contribution to the plot? After that, events occur with them, which like with, uh, events occur with the characters, which leads to the twist and plot. That is the next C, catch. After that. 
the protagonist that is the main character will create an impact which will change and create case to point which will give a message for the story so this was the last topic of articulation we have come to an end to the journey of the articulation if any doubts or concerns please do ask in the comments below or you are most welcome to our telegram channel which is also mentioned in the description box below thank you all for watching our videos like share and subscribe to our channel for other topics and mcqs related to wings one happy learning